The Haunted Mansion, True Stories of Old World Ghosts. In the secluded countryside of England, surrounded by dense woods and rolling hills, stands the centuries-old Everwood Mansion. Once a grand estate, it now looms as a shadowy relic of its former glory. The mansion has a dark history, with numerous tales of tragedy and death, and is said to be haunted by spirits from the past. The Arrival One autumn evening, a historian named Daniel arrived at Everwood Mansion. He was researching the estate's history for a book. Despite the locals' warnings, Daniel was intrigued by the stories and determined to uncover the truth. As he entered the mansion, the door creaked loudly, and a chill ran down his spine. The first encounter as Daniel began his research, he felt an unexplainable presence. Late at night, while reading in the library, he heard faint whispers and the sound of footsteps echoing in the empty halls. Suddenly, a cold breeze swept through the room, extinguishing his candle. In the dim moonlight, he saw a shadowy figure standing by the window, staring at him with hollow eyes. Dot the mansion's history. Determined to uncover more, Daniel delved deeper into the mansion's history. He discovered that the ghost belonged to Lady Eleanor, a former owner who died tragically. Her husband, Sir Reginald, had gone mad with grief and disappeared soon after. The mansion was left abandoned, with rumors of their spirits haunting the halls. The haunting intensifies. As days turned into nights, the hauntings grew more intense. Daniel experienced objects moving on their own, chilling whispers in his ear, and unsettling visions of Lady Eleanor wandering the halls. One night, he saw her standing at the end of his bed, her eyes pleading for help. She whispered, free me. The final revelation. Determined to help Lady Eleanor, Daniel searched for clues that might explain her unrest. In a hidden chamber behind the library, he found Sir Reginald's journal. The final entries revealed his descent into madness and the existence of a secret passage leading to the family tomb. Armed with this knowledge, Daniel ventured into the dark passage. Dot the release. In the tomb, Daniel found the remains of Lady Eleanor and Sir Reginald. He performed a small ritual, speaking words of peace and closure. As he finished, a warm light enveloped the tomb and Lady Eleanor's spirit appeared one last time. She smiled, finally free from her earthly torment, and faded into the light. The Aftermath With Lady Eleanor's spirit at peace, the haunting ceased. Daniel left Everwood Mansion, his heart heavy with the weight of what he had experienced, but also filled with a sense of accomplishment. The mansion remained a somber reminder of the past, but it was now free from its ghostly inhabitants.